Suryan the Frugal Chef. Why don't I show you how to take the membrane off ribs? This is fast, it's easy, very recommended if you're going to be cooking ribs. I'm going to show you on some beef ribs which we'll later cook in the oven. Okay, let me show you. All right, let me show you how to remove the membrane from the back of ribs. This is a rack, a small rack of beef short ribs. Uh, all ribs have this membrane. It's good to remove it so that you can, you know, enjoy the rib better. Uh, it's easier to cut, easier to eat, even for flavor and everything. It's a good thing to do. Pork spare ribs have them. Baby back ribs have them. They all do, and it's very simple to do. Okay, let me show you. So you're gonna grab a knife and you're gonna just start separating this membrane uh, from one corner. Separate it enough. So now we're just gonna pull this with a paper towel or I'm using a, um, a napkin, a large napkin. I'm actually gonna turn this around so it's easier for me to work. All I'm going to do is pull it off. Just like that. How cool is that? <laughs> See, this is, it, it's hard. So it just affects the quality of your ribs. And that, my friends, is how you remove the membrane from the back of a rack of ribs. I'm going to see you guys soon.